Hi, welcome to EPG Patshala Spanish. We are in the paper entitled Advanced Spanish Grammar. I am Gaurav Kumar and I teach Spanish in the center of Spanish, Portuguese, Italian and Latin American studies in Jawaharlal Nehru University, New Delhi. The title of this module is Present Subjunctive 3 and we shall continue with the topic of the present subjunctive in this module as well. We will discuss the uses of the present subjunctive with impersonal verbal phrases. In the earlier module, you learn that how certain verbs when present in the main clause require the subjunctive to be used in the dependent clause. You may recall that always there were two subjects involved in such cases, one in the main clause and the other in the dependent clause. And it was necessary that both these subjects were different in order to fulfill the criteria for using the subjunctive. In this module, we will cover sentences where the main clause is not having a particular subject. In Spanish, there are many expressions that are considered impersonal because they do not have a specific person <coughs> as the subject in the first clause of the sentence. They are always conjugated in the third person singular form El, Ella and Usted because the subject is it. The general format for such clauses is Es followed by adjective then K Es plus adjective plus K plus dependent clause. Let us take some examples. Es importante que la policía llegue a tiempo para controlar a los manifestantes. I repeat. Es importante que la policía llegue a tiempo para controlar a los manifestantes. In English, it is important that the police arrives on time in order to control the protesters. As you can see, es importante que doesn't have a personal subject such as yo, tu, el, ella, nosotros, etc. The dependent clause, la policía llegue a tiempo para controlar a los manifestantes, has the verb llegar in subjunctive as llegue corresponding to the subject police. Attention needs to be paid that one must not assume just because a sentence follows the ASK format that the subjunctive will be automatically applicable. Not every impersonal expression uses subjunctive. There are a few expressions that do not imply any doubt, rather they express certainty and are followed by the indicator, not the subjunctive. We will see such expressions later, but first we will discuss the ones that need the subjunctive. An impersonal expression needs to express wishes, emotions, impersonal expressions, recommendations, doubt or denial and ojala, God willing, in order to be followed by the subjunctive. In the same order as mentioned, they can be memorized as an acronym, VERDO, where 
W stands for wishes, E stands for emotions, I stands for impersonal expressions, D for doubt or denial and O for the okhala. Let us see the impersonal expressions that use the subjunct. First one, es importante que, es importante que, which means it is important that. Let us see some sentences. Es importante que saludes a tus amigos. I repeat, es importante que saludes a tus amigos. In English, the translation is, it is important that you greet your friends. Let us take another example. Ya eres mayor de edad y no es importante que siempre pidas permiso a tus padres. I repeat, ya eres mayor de edad y no es importante que siempre pidas permiso a tus padres. The English translation of the same is, you are an adult now and it is not important to always ask for your parents' permission. Next example is that of es bueno que, which means, it is good that. Let us take some sentences. Es bueno que los niños practiquen yoga desde una edad pequeña. I repeat. Es bueno que los niños practiquen yoga desde una edad pequeña. In English, the translation is, it is good that children practice yoga from an early age. Another example is, No es bueno que Isabela siempre se queje cuando tiene tarea. I repeat, No es bueno que Isabela siempre se queje cuando tiene tarea. In English, the translation is, It is not good that Isabel always complains when she has homework. Next example is that of es imposible que, which means it is impossible that. Let us see some examples. Es imposible que los alumnos traduzcan esto sin diccionario. I repeat, es Imposible que los alumnos traduzcan esto sin diccionario. In English, the equivalent translation is, It is impossible that the students translate this dictionary. The next example of impersonal verbal phrase is, Es imposible que, which means, it is impossible that. Let us see the example of a sentence. Es imposible que los alumnos traduzcan esto sin diccionario. I repeat. Es imposible que los alumnos traduzcan esto sin diccionario. The English translation is it is impossible that the students translate this without a dictionary. Let's take the next example. Es absurdo que, which translates as it's absurd that. Es absurdo que no se conozcan, son hermanos. I repeat. Es absurdo que no se conozcan, son hermanos. The English version is, it is absurd that they don't know each other. They are brothers. Next is, es aceptable que, which means, 
it's acceptable that in a sentence let us see how it works no es aceptable que los trabajadores lleguen tarde al trabajo i repeat no es aceptable que los trabajadores lleguen tarde al trabajo in english it is not acceptable that the workers arrive late to work next case is that of es curioso que which means it's odd strange curious that es curioso que nadie quiera ir de vacaciones a singapore i repeat es curioso que nadie quiera ir de vacaciones a Singapore. The translation is, It's strange that nobody wants to go on vacations to Singapore. Next example is, Es difícil que, which means, It is unlikely that. Es difícil que ellos devuelvan tu dinero. I repeat. Es difícil que ellos devuelvan tu dinero. In English, it is unlikely that they will return your money. Next example is. Es dudoso que or I do that ke, which means it is doubtful that. Es dudoso que terminemos el trabajo hoy. Or we can say, I do that que terminemos el trabajo hoy. I repeat, es dudoso que terminemos el trabajo hoy. Or I duda que terminemos el trabajo hoy. The English translation is, It is doubtful that we will finish the work today. Next is the case of es extraño que, which means it's odd, strange, that. Let us see a sentence. Es extraño que Felipe llegue tarde. Es muy puntual en general. I repeat. Es extraño que Felipe llegue tarde. Es muy puntual en general. The English version is. It's strange that Felipe arrives late. Normally, he is very punctual. Next case is, es extraordinario que, which means, it's extraordinary, amazing, that. Es extraordinario que te hayan ascendido de puesto. I repeat, es extraordinario que te hayan ascendido de puesto. The English translation is, It's amazing that they gave you a promotion. Next case is, Es fácil que, which means, It is likely that. Es fácil que ellos castiguen al ladrón. I repeat, es fácil que ellos castiguen al ladrón. The English translation is, it is likely that they will punish the thief. Next case is, es fantástico que, which means, it is fantastic that. Es fantástico que aprendas flamenco. I repeat, es fantástico que aprendas flamenco. 
in English. It is fantastic that you are learning flamenco. Next case is es hora que, which means it is time that. Es hora que ustedes ya me escuchen. I repeat, es hora que ustedes ya me escuchen. The English version is, it is high time that you listen to me. Es horrible que, which means, it's horrible, dreadful, awful that. Es horrible que los niños no amen a sus padres. I repeat, es horrible que los niños no amen a sus padres. The English translation, it's awful that the children do not love their parents. Next is the case of es improbable que, which means it is unlikely that. Es improbable que se ahogue porque él es un nadador profesional. I repeat, es improbable que se ahogue porque él es un nadador profesional. The English equivalent is, it is unlikely that he will drown because he is a professional swimmer. Next is, es inaceptable que, which means, it's inacceptable that. Es inaceptable que entregues tu tarea tarde. I repeat, es inaceptable que entregues tu tarea tarde. The English version is, it's unacceptable that you turn in your homework late. Next case is, es incierto que, which means, it's uncertain that. Es incierto que venga mi hermana para mi cumpleaños. I repeat, es incierto que venga mi hermana para mi cumpleaños. In English, it is uncertain that my sister comes for my birthday. Let us now see the next example. Es increíble que, which means it is incredible that. Es increíble que duermas casi todo el día. I repeat, es increíble que duermas casi todo el día. In English, it is incredible that you sleep almost the whole day. Next example is, es interesante que, which means, it's interesting that. Es interesante que los profesores también jueguen al fútbol con los alumnos. I repeat. Es interesante que los profesores también jueguen al fútbol con los alumnos. The English translation is, it is interesting that the professors also play football with the students. Next is the case of es inútil que that translates as there is no point in. Es inútil que vayan ahora ya es muy tarde. I repeat Es inútil que vayan ahora. Ya es muy tarde. There is no point in you all going now. It's too late. 
Next is the case of es justo que, which means it's fair or just that. No es justo que tengamos una prueba hoy. I repeat, no es justo que tengamos una prueba hoy. In English, it's not fair that we have a test today. Next case is, es una lastima que, which means, it is a shame that, or it's a pity that. Es una lastima que no vayas a la fiesta. I repeat, es una lastima que no vayas a la fiesta. In English, it's a pity that you aren't going to the party. Next is, es malo que, which means, it is bad that. Es malo que los seres humanos contaminemos nuestro medio ambiente. I repeat, es malo que los seres humanos contaminemos nuestro medio ambiente. In English, it is bad that we human beings pollute our environment. Next example is, es maravilloso que, or es una maravilla que, which means it's wonderful, amazing, awesome that. Es maravilloso que Salman Khan visite nuestro colegio. I repeat, es maravilloso que Salman Khan visite nuestro colegio. In English, it's awesome that Salman Khan will visit our school. Next is, es mejor que, which means, it is better that, or best that. Es mejor que no le preguntes nada del accidente. I repeat, es mejor que no le preguntes nada del accidente. In English, it is better that you don't ask him anything about the accident. Coming to the next example, es menester que, which means, it's necessary that. Es menester que entreguen la solicitud lo más pronto posible. I repeat, es menester que entreguen la solicitud lo más pronto posible. In English, it's necessary that you turn in the application as soon as possible. Es necesario que, which means it is necessary that. No es necesario que todos los alumnos participen en las actividades extraescolares. I repeat, no es necesario que todos los alumnos participen en las actividades extraescolares. In English, it is not necessary that all the students participate in the extracurricular activities. Next example is, es normal que, which means it's normal that. Es normal que llueva en todo el mes de julio en la India debido a la estación de monzón. I repeat, 
¿Es normal que llueva en todo el mes de julio en la India debido a la estación de monzón? En inglés, it's normal that in India it rains in the whole month of July because of the monsoon season. Es una pena que, which means, it's a pity, shame, or sad that. Es una pena que vaya solo al baile. I repeat, es una pena que vaya solo al baile. In English, it's a pity you are going to the dance alone. Next is the case of es posible que, which means it is possible that. Es posible que ella te compre la entrada para el concierto de Shakira. I repeat, es posible que ella te compre la entrada para el concierto de Shakira. In English, it is possible that she buys you the ticket for Shakira's concert. Next is the case, es preciso que, it is necessary that. Es preciso que envíes la solicitud a tiempo. I repeat. Es preciso que envíes la solicitud a tiempo. In English, the translation is. It is necessary that you send the application on time. Next is the example of. Es preferible que. That means, it is preferable that. Es preferible que el profesor lo explique. I repeat, es preferible que el profesor lo explique. In English, it is preferable that the professor explains it. Next is, es Raro que, it's strange, odd, funny, that. Es raro que se anochezca tan temprano. I repeat, es raro que se anochezca tan temprano. In English, it is strange that it gets dark so early. Next is the example of es ridículo que which means it is ridiculous that es ridículo que él no sepa la dirección a su propia casa. I repeat Es ridículo que él no sepa la dirección a su propia casa. In English, it is ridiculous that he doesn't know the direction to his own house. Next is the case of es sorprendente que or Es una sorpresa que, which means, it is surprising that. Es sorprendente que no me haya llamado todavía. I repeat, es sorprendente que no me haya llamado todavía. In English, it is surprising that. He has not called me yet. Next is, es terrible que, which means, it is terrible that. 
es terrible que los hermanos se peleen tanto. I repeat. Es terrible que los hermanos se peleen tanto. In English, it is terrible that the brothers fight so much among themselves. Next is es triste que, which means it is sad that. Es triste que Panchito no tenga un cuarto propio. I repeat, es triste que Panchito no tenga un cuarto propio. In English, it is sad that Panchito doesn't have his own room. Next example is, es útil que, which means, it's useful, practical, helpful, dar. Es útil que terminemos la tarea ya, en vez de hacerla en casa. I repeat, es útil que terminemos la tarea ya, en vez de hacerla en casa. In English, it's useful that we finish the homework now instead of doing it at home. Next example is no es que, which means it's not that. No es que tenga planes, es que no tengo interés en salir con él. I repeat, no es que tenga planes, es que no tengo interés en salir con él. In English, the translation is, it's not that I have plans, it's just that I am not interested in going out with him. Next is the example of Conviene que, which means, it is advisable that. No conviene que visites sin avisar de antemano. I repeat, no conviene que visites sin avisar de antemano. In English, the translation is, it is not advisable that you visit without informing in advance. Let us see another example. Conviene que usted llame mañana. Conviene que usted llame mañana. In English, it's advisable that you call tomorrow. As you can see, the construction of convene que does not follow the es plus adjetivo plus que format. We are going to see some more examples which do not follow the same structure as es que. The next example is mas vale que which means it is better or it's for the best. Mas vale que tus amigos te protejan. I repeat, mas vale que tus amigos te protejan. In English, it is better that your friends protect you. Again, in this construction, there is no S or K involved. It is mas vale que and not S plus adjective plus K. Let us see another example which is different from the S K format. Puede ser que or puede que. That means it may be that or it's 
possible dar. Puede ser que Luisa no siga asistiendo a esa escuela. I repeat. Puede ser que Luisa no siga asistiendo a esa escuela. In English, the translation is, it's possible that Luisa will not continue attending that school. The following impersonal expressions are not used with the subjunctive in the affirmative sentences, but if used in the negative, then they can go with the subjunctive form in the dependent clause. Let us first see the indicative forms. Es está claro que, which means it is clear or obvious that. Está claro que el ladrón le miente al policía. I repeat, está claro que el ladrón le miente al policía. In English, the equivalent translation is, it is clear that the thief is lying to the policeman. Let us take some more examples where this indicative is used in affirmative sentences. Es cierto que, which means, it is certain that. Es cierto que no tenemos bastante tiempo. I repeat, es cierto que no tenemos bastante tiempo. In English, the translation is, it is certain that we don't have enough time. The next example is that of es evidente que, which translates as, it is evident that. Es evidente que las tarifas cambian. I repeat, es evidente que las tarifas cambian. In English, it is evident that the tariffs change. Next is, es un hecho que, which means, it's a fact that. Es un hecho que el Everest es la montaña más alta del mundo. I repeat, es un hecho que el Everest es la montaña más alta del mundo. In English, it means, it's a fact that Everest is the tallest mountain in the world. Next is, es obvio que, which means, it's obvious that. Es obvio que la película le interesa a la gente. I repeat. Es obvio que la película le interesa a la gente. In English, the translation is, It's obvious that people find the movie interesting. Next example is, Es una realidad que, which means, it's a reality that. Es una realidad que el calentamiento global ha llegado a niveles peligrosos. I repeat, es una realidad que el calentamiento global ha llegado a niveles peligrosos. In English, it's a reality 
that global warming has reached dangerous levels. Next example is Es verdad que which means it is true that Es verdad que tú mereces buenas notas. I repeat Es verdad que tú mereces buenas notas. In English, the translation is It is true that you deserve good grades. Next is Esta or es seguro que Which means it's certain for sure that Esta seguro que van mañana. I repeat Está seguro que van mañana. It's certain that they are leaving tomorrow. Next is No es dudoso que or No hay duda que which means there is no doubt that No hay duda que el señor Rajoy Es el nuevo primer ministro. Or, no hay duda que el señor Rajoy es el nuevo primer ministro. The same sentence can be said with the expression no cabe duda que. No cabe duda que el señor Rajoy Es el nuevo primer ministro. Both these sentences translate as It is not doubtful that Mr. Rakhoi is the new prime minister. But do remember that in the expression Hay duda que el señor Rakhoi sea el nuevo primer ministro It is subjunctive because it implies doubt. The impersonal expressions are interesting to learn and its combinations with the subjunctive are very useful. We have discussed with many examples the various possibilities of the subjunctive and also exceptions where it is not used. Thank you. Gracias.